Hey, thanks for tuning in. My name is Tasha, and I've been searching for the best deals to get you started on your at-home t-shirt business. All the items that I found will be linked in the description. And guess how much the total was? Bring it in. Bring it in. $292. You can't beat that to start an at-home business. Stop playing. And on top of that, I'll be showing you how to use everything. Come on, you can't beat that. I'll be making this shirt just so you can see how everything works. So enough talking, let's get to business so we can get to the money. Okay, starting off, this is the list of Amazon items that I found to get you started for under $300. I searched high and low on Amazon to find you the best deals to get you started on a budget. Because you don't wanna spend a ton of money when you start just in case you decide that this is not for you because everything is not for everybody so first off here is my heat press i got the swing away heat press it was a bundle deal that came with a head press mug press and plate press so it was just a little bit more in price than just buying a heat press alone here's the price of a swing away heat press now this is the second option which is the clamshell heat press. I chose this one because it comes with Teflon sheets. I'll show you how everything is used later on in the video and everything will be linked down in the description. Here's a picture of Teflon sheets. Okay, let's move on to the next item, which is the Cricut Explore Air 2. It's a Bluetooth cutting machine that cuts over 100 different types of material. Okay, so $165 was the cheapest Cricut Explore Air 2 that I could find on Amazon. And the reason it's cheaper because Cricut has the new Air 3 out, which is $100 more. But if you're anything like me, I won't buy the upgrade first. I'll buy the one right before the new one because it usually works the same for a much cheaper price. Here is a heat transfer bundle. You get a 23 pack of 12 by 10 assorted colors of HTV vinyl for $7.99. This is a great bundle for practicing. This is one of the most important tools that you need. It's called a weeder. And I found this one for $3.49. But I'm here to tell you that you can purchase one from Dollar Tree. This is heat resistant tape. And this is another essential item. I found a two-pack on Amazon for $5.85. Gildan are great starter shirts because they're decent quality for the price. And they also have tearaway labels. Michaels is a good place to buy Gildan shirts to start practicing with because they're always running some type of sale. As of today, they're running a sale. Buy two, get one free. So basically, you get three t-shirts for $9.99. So I'm in Etsy where I buy a lot of my PNGs and SVGs. Today, I want to make a shirt that says Craftologist. And I found one for $1.20. Okay, I'm in Cricut Design Space. The software that Cricut offers you when you buy a Cricut cutting machine. And it's free to use. But for the pro version, it's $9.99. But when you first join, you get 30 days for free. So now you see me adding the file that I just purchased on Etsy. I am uploading the SVG to Cricut Design Space so I can size the image that the Cricut is going to cut. Here is the Cricut cut machine cutting the image in real time. Keep in mind that the Cricut machine does not print. And this is the weeder that I mentioned earlier. It's used to pull the excess vinyl from the backing. So now that the Cricut is done cutting, I'm going to weed out my image. This is how my image looks after I am done weeding. Here is some Cricut brand heat resistant tape. But this is the tape that I mentioned earlier. Both of them does the same thing. The Cricut tape is just a little bit higher, so you be the judge. So here we have the image taped down to the shirt. And now I'm going to lay the Teflon sheet on top to protect the vinyl from the heat press. Now I'm going to press the shirt at 350 degrees on 30 seconds. Now that the shirt has been pressed, 
I'm going to pull the vinyl off while it's hot. Some vinyls are hot pills and some are cool pills. So make sure you read the directions on the vinyl pack. Remember I told you earlier about the tearaway labels on the gilding shirts? Well here I am going to tear away the label and put my logo that I cut with the Cricut machine. I also have a video on how I make my labels in Cricut Design Space. So make sure you check it out. So I'm going to take down the label and heat press it the same way I did the front of the shirt. This vinyl is a cool peel so I had to let it cool for about 45 seconds before I peeled off the backing. Okay check this out. I did all the research and shopping for you. Now go click them links and make that purchase and invest in yourself so you can become the plug. What are you waiting for? It's money to be made. You can make that 300 back times 100. But if you got all the equipment and need more details on making shirts, click the video on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe. See you soon.